everyone, welcome back to another video. As some of you might know, I'm taking a trip to Germany. My bags are packed and I'm leaving today. And the reason for going there is because my son is getting married. I'm at the airport waiting to board my plane. It is 2.30 in the afternoon, my first day here in Edshausen, Germany, and it's like 24 degrees in the sun, it must be 30 degrees. I changed my clothes again, I am just really hot at the moment. just went shopping and I spent 18 euros, tax included, and this is about uh, 28 around $28. So the prices here are not expensive in this town of Edshausen. You can see what I got here and this treat. I'm going to show you this treat in a minute. I just love those. You don't get them in Canada. And this is like a cheese and this is a kefir here. And yeah, raisin bread and yeah, Kleenex and dish soap. So guys, this is what they look like. They are huge. I know in Canada you get these little mini ones. Look how big they are. I can't wait to bite in. They're so good. They smell good already. I haven't had one of these for five years. Mmm. So good. They're actually not too sweet and really fluffy and with the chocolate coating around the outside it's just perfect flavor as you know i just went shopping and i'll show you guys my room and uh yeah it's really cozy here everything i need and i'm really happy to be here with my son and he did a great job preparing a beautiful room for me here is a really nice cozy bed with a feather cover, feather pillow, and a lamp. So there's my keyboard I left here five years ago and I'm gonna practice on it pretty soon. Yeah, and here I can have uh, some breakfast and prepare myself something. I'm gonna have coffee in a minute. Now I'm gonna go for a little walk and show you a little bit of this little town called Etzhausen. <laughs> So this is uh, the main street called Bahnstraße. Bahn means train. Up here is the train station, but I'm going to go down this way and take you all around the block here so you have a good look at how the, the streets and the houses look like in Germany. So the sidewalks are cobblestone and I'm going around the block here. And yeah, cars are parked. Uh, tight on the side of the road here and um, coming up to a shop on the left it's a hairdresser shop so here's a hair salon oh I see the post office So this is the post office and you can get all kinds of things in here like um, buns and little gifts. Here you can see in the window the variety of things that you can buy in here. Also school supplies. And over here is a cigarette machine. I haven't seen one of those for ages and that is a post office box. You might have noticed there is a gate in front of each house so no one can just walk up to the front door. And yeah, the houses are pretty big here. They're of course over a million euros if you buy a big house like that. Yeah, 
You might have noticed that the homes are very different than the houses in Canada. They're built different also. They have huge, uh, they build the homes with huge cement uh, bricks and then the outside of the homes are painted, usually in a light tone. And windows are also different. The windows open uh, like a door. And um, yeah, there's no screens in front of the windows like they are in Canada. There's a beautiful lilac tree, and that's one of my favorite flowers. That lilac smells so good on the way walking down here. Yeah, some people have a nice garden, some people have a little bit of a wild garden in front of their home. And some have uh, gates and some have like a cement wall in front of their home. And yeah, you cannot drive your car so easily in front of the house. So that's why most of them are parked on the street. Once I get to the next corner up there, there'll be the train station. I'm at the train station right now. The train is right over there. There's a lot of cars parked over here as people go to work on the train. Also the children, they go to school on the train. So let's have a look at the train station in Edshausen. Most of these bicycles belong to high school students that are going to the city because there's no high school here. They park their bicycle here and lock it up and then they pick up their bike again when they come home from school and yeah, they buy a train pass for the month and yeah, then they have to go down over here, down these uh, stairs, there are two train tracks that you can go to. Um, one is going to direction Darmstadt, the other one to the direction Frankfurt. I'm walking through the little tunnel here going to the train track one or two but I'm going to go to the train track one and this one is going towards Darmstadt. The other train track is going towards Frankfurt, like I mentioned before. And people are getting off and coming home from school or from work. So here's a schedule posted where you can look up when the trains are coming and going. Wow, look at that graffiti over there. So here in this um, machine you can buy your train ticket, you punch in your destination and the amount will come out what you need to pay. It comes a really fast train. Going straight through. Time to walk back to the street.
So I'm going to go up this way instead of the stairs and come out on the sidewalk again. So that was the Bahnhof, as you say in German. So here's a tiny park where you can sit down on a bench. There's a baker where I bought my buns this morning. Up ahead is an ice cream parlor and I'm heading back home. Thank you all for joining me today and tomorrow I'm going to Gorbach.